Eleanor Powell, a luminary of classic Hollywood cinema, distinguished herself among her contemporaries through her unparalleled dance prowess and charismatic screen presence. In an era dominated by iconic performers, Powell's unique ability to seamlessly blend tap dancing with technical precision set her apart. Her contributions to the entertainment industry during the mid-20th century reflect a distinctive combination of talent and tenacity that left an indelible mark. Considering Powell's extensive filmography, one might ponder which of her works resonates most deeply. Each of her performances carries a distinct charm, but the answer to this question often reveals a personal connection. Whether it be the dynamic athleticism displayed in Born to Dance or the timeless elegance of Broadway Melody of 1940, Powell's versatility as an actress and dancer offers audiences a rich tapestry of cinematic experiences. As we explore the legacy of Eleanor Powell, we invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal connections with this classic Hollywood icon. What work of hers holds a special place in your heart and why? Your stories and reflections provide a collective celebration of Powell's enduring impact on the silver screen. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. What is your favorite Eleanor Powell film and what makes it memorable for you? Share your thoughts and join the conversation about this legendary actress. Eleanor Powell, a notable actress, achieved recognition not only for her contributions to the silver screen, but also for her later involvement in religious programming. Following a brief retirement, Powell hosted The Faith of Our Children in 1954, a non-denominational religious program featuring appearances from film and sports stars. The show, lasting three seasons, earned her a regional Emmy Award for children's programming. In an interesting turn of events, after her retirement from the entertainment industry, Powell became a minister in the Unity Church. Upon her passing, her ashes found their resting place in a bronze replica of the Bible. The Cathedral Mausoleum at Hollywood Forever Cemetery became her final abode, where she rests alongside legendary figures like Rudolph Valentino and Peter Finch. Powell's journey from the glamorous world of Hollywood to a ministerial role reflects a unique aspect of her life adding a layer of depth beyond her iconic performances on screen. Her legacy endures not only in the annals of film history, but also in the spiritual realm, commemorated in the sacred setting of the Unity Church and Hollywood Forever Cemetery. Eleanor Powell, a trailblazing actress, showcased her versatility not just on screen, but also in the world of music. While her singing voice was often dubbed in films, she ventured into recording two records in 1935 with the Tommy Dorsey Orchestra. Despite lacking formal vocal training, Powell's renditions of You Are My Lucky Star and I've Got a Feelin' You're Foolin' revealed a pleasantly surprising aspect of her talent. In the realm of dance, Powell stood apart from her contemporaries. Unlike most film dancers of her time, she eschewed choreographers, crafting all her dance numbers independently. This distinctive approach allowed her to shine in solo performances, creating a lasting impact that set her apart from the crowd. Delving into Powell's early career, her collaboration with the legendary Bill Robinson in private shows during 1928 proved pivotal. These exclusive performances, held in the opulent homes of New York's high society, not only marked her introduction to tap dancing, but also laid the foundation for her journey into the world of entertainment. Eleanor Powell's multifaceted talents, from recording records to revolutionizing dance choreography, underscore a career marked by innovation and a relentless pursuit of excellence, making her an enduring icon in the annals of entertainment. At the age of 12, Eleanor Powell's journey into the world of entertainment began with a summer vaudeville review at the Ambassador Hotel. Spotted playfully performing acrobatics on the beach during a vacation in Atlantic City, she earned a modest $21 for her performances three times a week. This early exposure set the stage for her remarkable career. Powell's talents extended beyond the silver screen, as evidenced by her foray into the music industry. Despite her singing voice often being dubbed in films, she recorded two records in 1935 with the Tommy Dorsey Orchestra, showcasing an unexpected aspect of her talent. Notably, her renditions of You Are My Lucky Star and I've Got a Feelin' You're Foolin' revealed a musical versatility that added depth to her artistic repertoire. In the realm of dance, Powell stood out from her peers. 
Unlike many of her contemporaries, she eschewed choreographers, independently crafting all her dance numbers. This distinctive approach allowed her to shine in solo performances, leaving a lasting impact that set her apart. Her early career collaboration with the legendary Bill Robinson in private shows during 1928 marked her introduction to tap dancing and laid the foundation for her future in entertainment. Howell's multifaceted talents, from recording records to revolutionizing dance choreography, underscore a career marked by innovation and a relentless pursuit of excellence. This talented actress and dancer's impact extended even beyond her lifetime. In 1984, posthumously, she was honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame at 1541 Vine Street, solidifying her enduring legacy in the entertainment industry. The recognition she received speaks to the lasting influence of Eleanor Powell, an icon celebrated for her contributions to film and the performing arts. Eleanor Powell's early life was marked by a family dynamic that shaped her formative years. At just 11 months old, her parents separated, leading to a divorce when she was two. Shielded from potential scandal, Eleanor's mother informed her that her father had passed away. However, in a surprising turn of events in 1935 during the Boston run of At Home Abroad, Eleanor's father reintroduced himself. This revelation added a layer of complexity to Powell's personal history, intertwining family dynamics with her burgeoning career in the entertainment industry. Amidst her achievements in film and dance, Powell's role as the mother of actor Peter Ford is another aspect of her life worth exploring. Beyond her own stardom, she played a pivotal role in shaping the life and career of her son, contributing to the legacy of talent within the Ford family. In recognition of her unparalleled contributions to tap dancing, Eleanor Powell was posthumously inducted into the International Tap Dance Hall of Fame in 2002, becoming a part of its inaugural class. This acknowledgement underscores her lasting impact on the world of dance, solidifying her status as a trailblazer in the field. These facets of Eleanor Powell's life, from the complexities of her family history to her influence on the next generation of performers, paint a nuanced picture of the multifaceted icon. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, Powell's personal journey and lasting legacy continue to resonate in the realms of family, dance, and entertainment. As we bid adieu to this exploration of the remarkable career of actress Eleanor Powell, I invite you, dear reader, to step into the realm of personal reflection. Powell's grace and finesse on the silver screen have undoubtedly left an indelible mark on the tapestry of entertainment. As the curtain falls, consider the moments when Powell's performances ignited a spark within you. Perhaps it was the rhythmic tap of her shoes that resonated with your own heartbeat, or the way she effortlessly brought characters to life that linger in the corridors of your memory. In this quiet aftermath, let the magic of Powell's artistry kindle your thoughts. How has her work colored the canvas of your cinematic experiences? What memories of her performances remain etched in the recesses of your mind? This isn't merely a farewell, it's an invitation to share your personal connection with a luminary who graced the screen with unparalleled talent. Your reflections add layers to the narrative, creating a collective mosaic of appreciation for the brilliance that was Eleanor Powell. So, take a moment, reflect, share. Whether in the quiet solitude of your thoughts or in the vibrant exchanges with fellow enthusiasts, let the spirit of Eleanor Powell continue to dance through the corridors of our shared cinematic history. In closing, we extend our gratitude for your time and interest in this journey through the enchanting world of Eleanor Powell. May her legacy endure in the hearts of those who have been touched by her artistry. Until our paths cross again in the realm of storytelling and nostalgia, thank you.